안녕하세요 혼스푼 오늘 이제 EBS ASMR의 대단원의 막을 내리는 테스트 3를 아, 읽어보도록 하겠습니다 아, 교재를 가지고 같이 읽으셔도 되고 그리고 자기 전에 편하게 이렇게 들으면서 잠에 들으셔도 좋고요 어, 이제 영국식 발음과 미국식 발음 왔다 갔다 읽었었는데 아, 이 입에 좀잘안 맞았었는데 미국식 발음이 근데 이제 좀 하다 보니까 할수 있을 것 같아서 이제 미국식 발음으로 마무리 해보도록 하겠습니다. 어, 교재에서는 페이지 204페이지부터인데 아, 테스트 3라고 생각하고 되시면 좋을 것 같습니다. 자 오늘도 아, 힘차게 예. 여러분들 입장에서는 뭐 졸릴 때 들을 수 있겠지만 나는 힘차게 하고 자 시작해 보도록 하겠습니다. Test 3 Exercise 1 다음 글의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것은 Dear Miss Sanderson It is very unfortunate that I need to be drafting this letter. However, the worsening situation has forced me to submit a formal complaint. I have been renting from you for 10 years and you would agree that there is no doubt that I have paid rent every month either on time or even sometimes earlier. However, despite this, there has been no effort whatsoever on your part to deal with the noise disturbance of the neighboring unit I have brought to your attention multiple times. The noise which I have to deal with in the wee hours is terrible. I am afraid that I cannot stand the loud music happening at all hours in the next unit anymore. Besides this, they leave a pile of garbage at my doorstep almost every other day. I hope you look into this matter at your earliest convenience. Sincerely, Ms. Martinez. Exercise 2 다음 글에 드러난 샬롯의 심경 변화로 가장 적절한 것은 Charlotte tossed and turned all night, but when she woke up bright and early the next morning, she did not feel tired at all. She anxiously awaited by the clock, watching the minute hand inch closer and closer until it hit nine o'clock. She picked up the phone and dialed with shaky fingers. The line rang five times before someone picked up. Department of Anthropology, a woman's elegant voice answered on the other end. Although the woman's voice seemed uncertain at first, Charlotte couldn't believe her ears when the lady told her the position was still open and asked her, if she would like to come in for an interview that very afternoon. When Charlotte got off the phone, she immediately changed into a brown skirt, a white cotton blouse, and her best coat, encouraged by this promising job opportunity. She checked in the closet door mirror to make sure she looked decent before she rushed out to catch the bus, next bus. Exercise 3 다음 글에서 필자가 주장하는 바로 가장 적절한 것은 Being sensitive to understanding what resources students have outside of school is extremely helpful when trying to support student learning. Having worked with my own sons on their language arts homework at the primary level, I can see how students whose parents are English language learners are at a severe disadvantage when completing worksheets. If they do not understand or cannot read the directions or do, have the, do not have the cultural knowledge to help the students with their homework, then these students do not have these resources to assist them in learning. In addition, working or single parents may not have or may not extend the resource of time or energy to students 
So these special circumstances may leave these students at a disadvantage, disadvantage with both their daily homework and more extensive projects. Given these dilemmas, it is greatly appreciated when teachers can offer parents practical suggestions on how to help their students. Often, the parents simply do not know all the teaching tips and pedagogical knowledge to help their child improve their academic skills. Exercise 4. Bichurchin doesn't know where not to go. 가 다음 글에서 의미하는 바로 가장 적절한 것은 as Einstein said, we are often so smart we are stupid. Why? We know too much for our own good and it causes us to lose our childish curiosity. Until Roger Bannister broke the four-minute mile, no runner set it as a possible goal. The barrier was so rooted in the thinking of track and field athletes no one ever considered trying it. But when it was broken, high school runners all over the world began breaking it. Studies have shown that the salesperson who doesn't know where not to go often emerges with the big deals. Breaking traditional dogmas is what creativity is all about. The Pike Syndrome demonstrates why this is true. When pike are separated from the minnows located just beyond the glass barrier, they become conditioned not to go there. That is what happens to humans due to early conditioning. The pike will actually die after the glass is removed rather than swim to their food. Like the pike, people often are found self-destructing from within due to Superior past beliefs. Exercise 5. 다음 글의 요지로 가장 적절한 것은 Social scientists and lay persons alike have a lasting trust in the explanatory power and predictive validity of global attitudes. It appears intuitively compelling to argue, for example, that pro-environmental attitudes are conductive, conducive to participation in recycling efforts, that degree of job satisfaction influences work productivity, that pro-social attitudes determine willingness to dom donate blood, or that racial prejudice is responsible for biases in hiring decisions. Yet, as reason as reasonable as it appears, empirical research has provided very little sup support for the idea that performance of specific behaviors can be d predicted from global attitudes. In an early review of work on the attitude-behavior relation, Adzen and Fishbein discovered that among the 102 studies reviewed, 54 had assessed global attitudes and attempts to predict specific actions. Of these studies, 25 obtained non-significant results, and the remainder rarely showed cor correlations in excess of 40. A more recent meta-analysis revealed similarly low correlations between global attitudes and specific behaviors. Exercise 6. 다음 글의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은? An archaeological report usually aims to present data as objectively as possible. A strong basis for subsequent inference. Its strength comes from all those diagrams and photographs, the many words of detailed description, the references to comparative sites and materials which give further context to the findings. These all prove the actual happening of the excavation and the trustworthiness of the excavation team. Where otherwise is the quality of objectivity? Because the report is coherent and reads well, 
no contradictions betraying lies and artifice, and the photographs witness things actually being found because its style and rhetoric are found acceptable because it delivers what it required from format to types of information. It is described as sound. Objectivity is what is held together. If a report holds together, it is considered objective. Exercise 7. 다음 글의 제목으로 가장 적절한 것은? Words. Printed thoughts are at a very peak of power today. Even in ancient civilizations, Greek and Roman, it was chiefly orators, poets, and writers who made men act. Oratory has dimmed in power only because of its physical limitations, which radio now has to some degree removed. The printed word, through the genius of the automatic printing press, as now an audience of enormous size, scope, flexibility, and trained attention. It is literally the cement which connects the countless bricks of humanity together in the structure we call civilization. A blackness comparable to night would settle down upon humanity if its printed word facilitates were suddenly to become instinct, extinct. It would be a kind of mental death. A taste of it has been experienced by the intellectuals of Russia, who for a while remained almost completely without books, without paper and pencils, without periodicals, without scientific writings, or even mail communication. Exercise 8. Warren Miller에 관한 다음 글의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것은? Warren Miller, the ski lover who became a filmmaker and author, born in Hollywood, California in 1924, took up skiing and surfing as a child. After his discharge, fr discharge from the Navy in 1946, he bought a camera and while living in a trailer in the parking lot of Sun Valley Ski Report, began to film his friend Ward Baker and himself in an effort to improve their skiing technique. At first, Miller would show the films and narrate to friends. Friends, friends turned into parties and parties turned into crowds. Before long, Miller had pieced together a full-length feature and would be touring in 130 cities a year. In reference to his prolific career, Miller wanted to tell stories and have the film to back it up. It was a labor of love for Miller, whose first experience on snow was transformational. It was total freedom, but absolutely no control over it. In the years that followed, Miller would be recognized 10 times for the Sene Golden Eagles Award, 8 times for the IFPA, Industry Film Producers Association, Award, and the International Documentary Achievement Award, to name a few. Exercise 9. 다음 도표의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것은? Percentage of U.S. adults who say the following about actions people can do in everyday life to help protect the environment. The graph above shows U.S. adult responses when asked about five types of individual actions they can take in everyday life to help protect the environment. About two-thirds of say, two-thirds say, that using fewer single-use plastics makes a big difference in helping protect the environment. About half of U.S. adults say the same about driving less of carpooling and re reducing their food waste. About a quarter of U.S. adults say that eating less meat makes a big difference in helping protect the environment. 
The gap between people's opinions on how useful an act is to protect the environment and their action, actual actions is largest in reducing food waste and second largest in using fewer single-use plastics. When it comes to driving less or carpooling, the gap between people's opinions about effectiveness and actually taking the action is very small. At only one percent point. Exercise 10. 2021 Meadows High School video contest in Kwanan. 다음 안내문의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것은? 2021 Meadows High School video contest. The Meadows High School's annual video contest is here. This year's theme is Global Climate Change. Enter for a change, chance to win great prizes. Contest rules. Work individually or form a group. Up to four. Open only to current Meadows High School students. Choose a topic related to global climate change. Create an Original, informative video that focuses on your chosen topic, no longer than two minutes. Using copyrighted materials is prohibited. Submit your video via, via email to meadows at hs.kr. All submissions must be received by September 20th 2021. Videos will be judged on how well they illustrate global climate change problems. Prizes $100 first place, $50 second place, $30 third place. For full contest details, visit www.meadows.hs-vc. 2021. Dot. Exercise 11. Smoke Free Heroes 3 on 3 Basketball Tournament. 에 관한 다음 안내문의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것은? Smoke Free Heroes 3 on 3 Basketball Tournament. Participate in the Smoke Free Heroes 3 on 3 Basketball Tournament to help patients suffering from lung cancer. The game plan, date and times, Friday, July 9th, 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. And Saturday, July 10th, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Entry fee, $100, $100 per team. There is a three-player minimum and five-player maximum per team. Games are played to 21 points. If neither team has reached 21 points after 15 minutes, the team with more points is the winner. If it's a tie after 15 minutes, the team who scores the next point wins. Registration Information Each team must submit a registration form to our office in the Silverage Center building. Deadline Wednesday, July 7th. Tournament matchups and times will be released on our website on Thursday, July 8th. All participants will receive a free tournament t shirt. The profits gained from the basketball tournament will be used to help lung cancer patients and research. For questions about the tournament, please contact Jonathan Lee at 210-547-9048 or via our website. Exercise 12 다음 글에 밑줄 친 부분 중 어법상 틀린 것은? Our ability to joke about things that are painful or forbidden is a valuable asset. A handle on sanity is a mad world. 
We tell jokes because human existence is an un unforgiving slog. We tell them in the face of overwhelming odds and despite the ravages of time and fate. Notwithstanding the fact that our natural good humor may be soured by the blows life aims at us. We joke and laugh all the more. Wherever human beings are oppressed by corrupt government, poverty, or merely the specter of disease and death, jokes thrive. In these circumstances, the fundamental human insistence on laughing despite it all makes the joke a noble thing. According to U.S. standing up comic Albert Brooks, when the time comes where there literally is no ability to extract laughs from a subject, it's really the end of the world. I mean, people with horrible diseases makes, make jokes till the end. It's like the armor against being completely eaten and gone from the planet. Exercise 13 다음 글에 밑줄 친 부분 중 문맥상 낱말의 쓰임이 적절하지 않은 것은? Briefly, animal communication systems seem to be seem to be of two sorts. First, birds have a fixed and fairly small repertoire of distinct signals, each of which has a set function. Flight call, alarm call, and the like. A particular environment elicits the appropriate response. Human language does not consist in such a small fixed repertoire of predictable responses. Second, consider bees. A bee returning from a distant food source dances the message. The positioning of the dance and its pattern indicate the direction and the distance of food source. This remarkably efficient system of communication differs from those of birds in having an unlimited number of signals. The length and the pattern are capable of so many vi vi uh, variations. Nevertheless, the B system is not flexible in the way human language is. Each response is environmentally fixed. If you know where the bee has been, and if you know the coding system, you can predict the pattern of the dance. In contrast, if a person comes from a food source, a good restaurant for example, you cannot predict her words. Her food description, indeed, whether she talks about food at all, is stimulus independent. Exercise 14 다음 빈칸에 들어갈 말로 가장 적절한 것은? We frequently adjust our daily behaviors, the ways in which we interact with each other, develop relationships, and perform our jobs based on the introduction of ever-evolving technologies. And some experts argue that we have not yet adapted to an environment that is, and will continue to be, a moving target. The New York Times journalist Matt Richel documents the gap between the pace of innovation and the pace of evolution, arguing that humans beings, human beings need to learn to adapt to technology in a world that is changing way, way faster than we can evolve. Richel in anal analyzes our experience with technology with the way we confront junk food, pointing out that just as we have not changed at the pace that food has industrialized, so we can, we don't metabolize junk food any better than we did 50 years ago. The difference, according to Richel, is that we have learned that we must be careful with junk food and limit its consumption. We have not yet learned to effectively regulate our take of technology, exposing ourselves to the potential consequences emanating from overuse thereof.
Exercise 15. 다음 빈칸에 들어갈 말로 가장 적절한 것은 Research on the Bushmen of the Kalahari Desert showed that the idea that our prehistoric ancestors had a hard life of unremitting toil was not true. They only worked when they had to, did not store food, and had few wants, which were easily satisfied. They only had to take up their spears and go hunting when more food was needed. As a result, they worked only 15 hours a week. There would have been no point in working more. Some have called them the first affluent society. The missing ingredient, however, was money. Money can be stored more easily than food and can be exchanged for a multiplicity of their other things. Without money, our ancestors no, saw no point in working longer than they had to. Had the Bushmen had money or other means of exchange, their lives might have been less leisured. Exercise 16 다음 빈칸에 들어갈 말로 가장 적절한 것은 Social facilitation refers to increases in an individual's supply of energy not necessarily to improvement in performance. Research on social facilitation has shown that the extra arousal derived from the presence of others positively affects performance only if the behaviors necessarily for high-quality performance are well-learned or the task is very simple. In other words, arousal increases the probability of dominant responses. If the task is very well learned or simple, high quality responses are likely to be dominant and the social facilitation simply increases the probability of those responses leading to enhanced performance. If the task is difficult or unfamiliar, correct responses are not likely to be dominant. In this case, arousal from social facilitation may increase the probability of incorrect behaviors, thereby leading to worse performance. Thus, social facilitation cuts both ways. The presence of others increases an individual's arousal level. Whether performance is improved or hurt depends on how difficult or unfamiliar the task is. Exercise 17 다음 빈칸에 들어갈 말로 가장 적절한 것은 Only lately has science illuminated how birds can be smart with a brain at best the size of a walnut. In 2016, a team of international scientists reported that their discovery of one secret. Birds pack more brain cells into a smaller space. When the team counted the number of neurons in the brains of 28 different bird species, ranging in size from the pin-sized zebra finch to the six-foot-tall emu, they found that birds have higher neuron counts in their small brains than do mammals or even primates of similar brain size. Neurons in bird brains are much smaller, more numerous, and more densely packed than those in mammalian and primate brains. This tight arrangement of neurons makes for efficient high-speed sensory and nervous systems. In other words, Say the researchers, bird brains have the potential to provide much higher cognitive clouds per pound than do mammalian brains. Exercise 18. 다음 글에서 전체 흐름과 관계 없는 문장은 Courses need to be created within a context that enables students to pursue their own interests for a for as long as they want to, 
without disallowing the possibility of switching interests at any time. This means the concept of a curriculum must include an understanding of how materials pertain to specific interests and how they convey general issues independent of a specific context. Once a student selects an interest, accomplishable goals, in terms of visible projects, will be pursued. Much of, these ki- much of the kind of knowledge now taught explicitly in school will be taught implicitly. Within the context of helping the student achieve the goals of the course he has selected for himself. Unfortunately, Assessing student knowledge is difficult because teachers can only infer student knowledge from observation of student performance. Teaching will occur as the student discovers his own need to know in order to accomplish whatever his current task is and in order to serve his higher level goals. Exercise 19 주어진 글 다음에 이어질 글의 순서로 가장 적절한 것은 People seem to have little difficulty in accepting the modifiability of environmental effects on human development. If a child has had bad teaching in mathematics, it is accepted that the resulting deficiency can be remedied by extra good teaching the following year. But any suggestion that the child's mathematical deficiency might have a genetic origin is likely to be greeted with something approaching the despair. If it is in the genes, it is written, it is determined, and nothing can be done about it. You might as well give up attempting to teach the child mathematics. This is sheer nonsense on an animal almost astrological scale. Genetic causes and environmental causes are, in principle, no different from each other. Some influences of both types may be hard to reserve, reverse. Others may be easy to reverse. Some may be usually hard to reverse, but easy if the right agent is applied. The important point is, that there is no general reason for expecting genetic influences to be any more irreversible than environmental ones. Exercise 20 주어진 글 다음에 이어질 글의 순서로 가장 적절한 것은 Our control over our abilities to perceive, remember, and emote has certain concrete limits which is itself a sign of the fundamental separateness of these abilities from the processes that do the controlling. A colorblind person, for example, cannot simply decide to start seeing colors correctly. An elderly person with a bad memory cannot simply decide to start remembering. A sociopath who fails to feel empathy for the people he harms cannot simply decide to start feeling empathy. However, our control over the actions we take on the basis of our perceptions, memories, and emotions is vastly greater. Once the colorblind person knows that he sees both red and green as green, he can take steps to ensure that his actions do not endanger himself or others. For instance, even though red and green traffic lights may look the same to him, he can memorize the position of the lights, red on top, green on the button, to make sure that he does not cause an accident. He can use executive processing to correct for a perceptual deficit. Exercise 21 그래, 흐름으로 보아 주어진 문장이 들어가기에 가장 적절한 것은 The computer algorithms that we call artificial neural networks are directly inspired by the hierarchical organization of the human cortex. 
like the human cortex, they contain a pyramid of successive layers, each of which attempts to discover deeper regularities than the previous one. Because these consecutive layers organize the incoming data in deeper and deeper ways, they are also called deep networks. Each layer, by itself, is capable of discovering only an extremely simple part of the external reality. Assemble many of these layers, however, and you get an extremely powerful learning device capable of discovering complex structures and adjusting to very diverse problems. Today's artificial neural networks, which take advantage of the advances in computer chips, are also deep in the sense that they contain dozens of successive layers. These layers become increasingly insightful and capable of identifying abstract properties the further away they are from the sensory input. Exercise 22. 그래, 흐름으로 보아 주어진 문장이 들어가기에 가장 적절한 곳은? As the power of scientists has increased, so has the value of association with science. The result of this transformation, transformation of science is paradoxical. On the other hand, 21st century science has the power to transform our lives and our understanding of the universe in ways we can barely imagine. The huge resources now available to scientists the tools at their disposal, and society's beliefs in the beneficence of science in general all contribute to the potential flowering of fascination and significant scientific results. On the other hand, this widespread exposure to science has led to both the fear of its power and the credulity that allows scientific correlations to spread lies with impunity. There is reason in both these dispositions, both these positions. Science showed its terrifyingly brutal face in the 20th century, and for many interests in peace, equity, or the environment, the way of science does not seem to offer answers to the massive problems facing us. Equally, science has become so complex that lay people cannot understand it. And so those claiming scientific discoveries and breakthroughs receive favorable reporting in the press and widespread acceptance with little critical examination. Exercise 23 다음 글의 내용을 한 문장으로 요약하고자 한다. 빈칸 A, B에 들어갈 말로 가장 적절한 것은? Ellen Langer and Judith Roden tested the importance of personal control by treating elderly patients in a high, highly rated Connecticut nursing home in one of two ways. With one group, the benevolent caregivers emphasized our responsibility to make this a home you can be proud of and happy in. They gave the patients their normal, well-intentioned, sympathetic care and allowed them to assume a passive care-receiving role. Three weeks later, most of these patients were rated by themselves, by interviewers, and by nurses as further debilitated. Langer and Roden's other treatment promoted personal control. It emphasized opportunities for choice, the possibilities for influencing nursing home policy, and a person's responsibility to make of your life whatever you want. These patients were given small decisions to make and responsibilities to fulfill. Over the following three weeks, 
93% of this group showed improved alertness, activity, and happiness. According to Langer and Roden's study of two groups of elderly patients, the group passively receiving care saw a decline in their health and well-being, while the elderly patients given chances for self-determination exhibited positive outcomes. Exercise 24 to 25. 다음 글을 읽고 물음에 답하시오. Conflict involves incompatible activities. People are in conflict when the actions of one person are interfering, obstructing, or in some other way making other uh, making another's behavior less effective. Team members arguing for different positions gets in the way, at least temporarily, if they're making a decision. Asking a question during a speech frustrates the prisoner's attempts to present his or her findings. What is crucial about defining conflict as incompatible activities is that it does not equate action with goals. A confusion often made in the writing and practice of conflict management. Team members argue for different solutions to a problem as a means to reach their goal of the best solution possible. Just because people's actions are incompatible does not mean that their desired end states are. Their goals and aspirations can still be compatible. They can still get where they want to go. Team members arguing different positions both want the solution that will make their team successful, but my contrasting proposals of how to accomplish this compatible goal. The person interrupting and the presenter may still have the compatible goal of understanding the material accurately. They have identical they have unidentical conclusions of how this goal can be accomplished. Of course, sometimes conflict is such that there are incompatible goals that make mutual benefit unlikely or even impossible. However, this incompatibility should be discovered, not assumed in the definition of conflict. Exercise 26 to 28. 다음 글을 읽고 물음에 답하시오. In 1665, London was at the mercy of the Great Plague. At the time, no one knew what caused it, but people did not know, but people did know that it spread most quickly where there were many people living side by side. So those who could, usually the rich, left town. The king and his court relocated to the city of Oxford. Those who lived deep in the countryside, particularly in isolated villages in remote regions, were far safer because, in fact, the plague was carried by fleas, which in turn were often carried by black rats. Tragically, one such isolated village did not escape the great plague's clutches. Someone in the Der Derbyshire, Derbyshire village of Ayam ordered some clothes from a London tailor. The tailor duly wrapped the clothes and had them delivered to the village in the last summer that day, that year. This simple, innocent act was in fact a dreadful mistake. As with so many clothes of the day, the clothes contained fleas. Fleas had carried the plague. By October, 25 people in the village side had died of it. It was then that the rector of A.M., William Mompesson, came up with a plan, which the villagers agreed to, to limit the possibility of their spreading the plague 
to other villages. Even though they did not know how it, it actually spread, they would cut themselves off from the outside world. They marked out a boundary around Aeum with stones and made arrangements that supplies would be left at agreed times on agreed days in agreed places on the boundary. To pay for the goods, they left money soaked in vinegar. Due to the highly contagious nature of the deadly plague, they hoped this would help contain it. This extraordinary act of courage worked in that it did stop the spread of the disease to their neighbors in the surrounding countryside, but at an incredible sacrifice to themselves. Over 259 villagers, more than two-thirds of the population of Aeum, had died. Their remarkable story, however, lives on. 여기까지 어, EBS ASMR 수능 특강 영어 전체를 마무리하도록 하겠습니다. 혹시라도 여러분들이 공부하다가 어, 더 듣고 싶은 부분이 있다든가 어, 평소에 읽어봤던 소설책 같은 거에서 어떤 이제 관심이 생기는 부분이 있으면 그런 것들을 댓글에 알려주시면 다른 거를 또 읽어보는 시간을 가져보도록 하겠습니다. 내신 공부에 도움이 되길 바라고 그리고 영어를 우리가 공부하는 데 있어서 다른 영어 지문들을 ASMR로 듣는 것보다 EBS가 의미가 있는 이유는 결국엔 EBS에 나와 있는 핵심 어휘들이나 혹은 거기에서 주로 사용되는 구문이나 문법들 그런 이제 문장 구조가 수능과 난이도가 유사하기 때문에 계속 난이도 유사한 수준에 있는 문장들을 듣다 보면은 아, 이 정도 호흡으로 글이 쓰여지는구나. 이 정도의 길이나 아니면 이 정도의 난해성이 문장 안에 들어가 있는구나. 라는 거를 좀 살펴볼 수 있을 거예요. 추가적으로 EBS는 이제 직접 명계가 되지 않기 때문에 간접 명계라는 차원에서도 글의 핵심 소재나 글의 핵심 주제 라는 것들이 수능에는 반영이 될 텐데 아 이런 이제 핵심 키워드들이 주로 사용되는 지문들을 자주 듣다 오면은 아 이런 이제 관련된 내용이 나오겠구나 라는 것이 조금 익숙해질 수는 있습니다. 그래서 뭐 어, 반드시 어, 매일매일 들어야 된다라기보다는 어떤 어, 시간이 날때 뭔가 힐링하는 차원에서 어, 나도 지금 그 힐링을 좀 하고 싶은데 여러분들도 그런 차원에서 힐링한다라는 생각으로 들으면 좋을 것 같습니다. 여기까지 해서 전체를 마무리해 보도록 하겠고 오늘도 좋은 하루 보내시고 그리고 내일도 좋은 하루 잘 시작했으면 좋겠습니다. 문스푼 이의 ASMR 마치도록 하겠습니다. 음.